Good morning. This is Christy Drake with Moody Radio's New Day Cafe. Today I'm speaking with Johnny Sales of Monroeville. Johnny is part of Pilots for Christ Ministries. Good morning, Johnny. Welcome to the program. Hey, Christy. Good morning. Good morning to all your listeners. All week long we are discussing defining moments. This morning I'd like to speak with you about a ministry that you are very involved with called Pilots for Christ. As we begin, can you just tell us what exactly Pilots for Christ is? Well, Pilots for Christ, it's strictly air transportation for people who can't fly commercially or they've got to be someplace in a heartbeat almost. Uh, People that their immune system sometimes have been compromised and they can't get on a commercial flight. Or, for example, most of our flights are are out to Houston or up to uh, Memphis, you know, to St. Jude, those, those kind of flights. And those people, they can't go and sit in an airport in Atlanta and wait an hour or two hours or or run around a mile to catch another flight to make their connection. We can get in the airplane here in Monroeville or pick you up, say, in Jackson, Alabama or Tuscaloosa and fly you to Houston and have you in Houston at MD Anderson in about two hours. That's what Pilots for Christ does. We we fly patients, we fly missionaries, we fly people that uh, are financially needy, we fly people that got plenty of money, we fly some people that are spiritually needy. And as I mentioned, we're speaking of defining moments this week. Can you share briefly how you got involved with this ministry? I had had a liver transplant and uh, literally was uh, sitting at the house. And, you know, there's only so much TV that you can you can watch. And uh, I couldn't move. I was just stuck in the chair. And uh, I was asking God then, I said, what what now? You know, how is it going to work? And got where I could move around a little bit. And we had gone to, to church to a Wednesday night supper. And we sat across from a friend of mine, uh, uh, Lindy Lee and Tommy Lee. And uh, we were sitting there. And my wife and I, when we got up, they were talking about Pilots for Christ. And I said, did, did you feel that? I said, I, I really feel God moving on us to, to try to help if, if, if we can. And so uh, Roz got to take the first flight with him. And then I got to fly, take a flight with him a couple of months later. And then about the end of February of this year, we had the, uh, the chance to uh, come down and begin to help them. And I'll tell you what, it seems that everything that we had learned in life, in, in our business life and, and, and uh, spiritual life and all, God had been training us for this one particular moment. So I know I'm exactly, and Roz knows that she is exactly where we're supposed to be. Uh, my friend Tommy knows he is exactly where he is supposed to be. Uh, this, is, this is what God has for us to do, and uh, we're, we're humbled by the way things happen, you know, the, uh, the way folks will you know, they, they look at us and say, y'all are a blessing to us because you fly these people and you do these things, and goodness, we're the ones that get the blessing. How many people would you say are involved in this ministry there in Monroeville? Well, in, in Monroeville itself, there's there's probably 20 people or so, you know, that that uh, that touch in with us and, and stuff that do different things. But uh, it's more than just Monroe County. Pilots for Christ, as far as what we're assigned, we have a 350-mile radius. And our Pilots for Christ organization, even though we're based in Monroeville, we're the only Pilots for Christ in the state of Alabama. There is not one in Georgia. There's not one in Louisiana. There's not one in Mississippi. So we cover all of those places. So we have individuals in each one of these different areas, you know, that that, that know about us, that that we would consider volunteers that, that help us and kind of point us in the right direction. And speaking of the volunteers... Are there people other than pilots that volunteer for this? Oh, absolutely. We've got uh, Sunday school teachers. We've got uh, uh, some people that uh, work at the hospitals. Now, I I say that they work at the hospitals, but we're not an air ambulance. We do not provide any kind of of, of care like that. But they're just good Christian people that that are there that can help. Speaking of how many flights you do and that this is a ministry, tell us a little bit about how Pilots for Christ is funded. We don't get any money from the government. We don't get any money from insurance. It turns out that it is purely donations. Uh, so far to date, Pilots for Christ here in Monroe, uh, they've been doing this for 20 years. Wow. And uh, uh, some people know about it. It's amazing how many people didn't know about it. Uh, just this year, well, I'd say over, over 20 years, we've flown 1,200 flights. Just this year, we've flown 69 flights already. 
because of your name, Pilots for Christ, your passengers would be aware that you are a Christian ministry. Well, Do you ever have the opportunity to share the gospel with your passengers? <laughs> always, always. We take the opportunity, you know, because that's that's what we're there for. We had one particular flight uh, that I remember, uh, and, and matter of fact, there's, there's, there's a couple of them that have been this way, and we've told the passengers, I mean, they were literally sent home to, to die. And we've told them, you know, say, look, we... You know, God has put you in our path for a reason, and uh, uh, this may be and probably will be the only time we get to talk to you, and we'll share what Jesus has done for us, what he's done for them, uh, that, that he's there available to everybody, that it's not by works, but it's by grace that we're saved. You can't be good enough, strictly a gift. We'll get that opportunity every flight. I'm sure that this conversation has sparked the interest of some of our listeners. If someone wants to find out more about Pilots for Christ, where can they go? Well, if you're on Facebook, if you spelled out Pilots for Christ all together without any spaces, and then a space, Monroeville space AL, uh, you'd pick us up on Facebook and just send us a friend request. Uh, if you want to go to our website, it's, of course, www pfc like pilots for christ al like alabama dot net so pfc al dot net and our phone number is 251-575-9425 and we're here all the time or you can leave us a message and it'll tell you how to get my cell phone number well johnny thank you so much for speaking to us this morning and sharing your heart for ministry our pleasure thank you so much christy Thanks for listening to Moody Radio. This is Christy Drake with New Day Cafe speaking with Johnny Sales of Monroeville. Johnny is a part of Pilots for Christ Ministries. To learn more about this or any other feature, email Cafe at moody.com.